Holy moly. This is an absolute giant. I don't think I've ever caught a tiger trout. Fish hawk. Tyler. <laughs> Let's go. Give me <laughs> There he is. Nice one. Oh, let's go. This is gonna be tough. What is up everybody, Fish Hawk here. Hope you guys are having a great day. If you're new here, consider subscribing. I put out new videos every single week. In this video, I'm with my buddy Colin back there fishing. He invited me down to Yellow Creek Trout Club uh, up in PA. And we're gonna do some trout fishing today. It's supposed to be a beautiful fall day high of 65 and sunny it got really cold last night and the water is very cold it's pretty clear and it's pretty low so it could be challenging but we're going to give it our best shot and hopefully get some fish in the net stay tuned fish on big rainbow Collins on. Oh wow. Gosh. <laughs> to start Dude, the day. Massive. To start the day. Now it's time for Tyler to get on a big one. This was caught on the RB version 2 Dynamic Lure HD Trout. Here's its release. <laughs> All right, guys, Colin just caught the first fish of the day. Now let's see if I can get one. Show you guys my setup for today. Six foot light fish hawk rod, Shimano Altegra 1000 reel, six pound test, P-line fluorocarbon. Down on this end, I have a two and a half inch gulp minnow. It's the smelt color, and I have it on a small trout magnet jig head. And about 18 inches above that, I have a trout magnet float. I love these floats because they're nice and adjustable. You can just slide them up and down the line. And when you're fishing creeks like this and you're fishing a floating rig, you wanna be able to adjust the depth at which your jig is sitting in the water. So it's really fast and simple to just slide this up and down your line. Got him, fish on. Here we go, boys. First fish of the day. Not a very big one. I can get him. I can get him. him. Yep, I got him. He's, he's not a very big one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Holy moly. Look at this fish, bro. Oh, Look at him. <laughs> Look at him. This is hilarious. This is the funniest fish I've ever seen. It's one like of the a, funniest trout. It's like a mini it's rainbow. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. First fish of the day. Little rainbow. Hopefully we can get some bigger ones. I know they're in there. He's just gonna chill. Were you expecting it? <sighs> Not really because I'd thrown over there several times. Um, the, one, the one bite that I did have was actually on this side of the rapids, like right up where the water's flowing. Yeah. That's where I had a good bite earlier, so I just expected to get, you know, bit over there. I actually just moved the, uh, the gulp minnow further down below the float. I adjusted it. When the first couple casts I made, I had it like only like 12 inches. And I just moved it to about 18 inches, so it's like riding a little lower in the water column. So I figured those fish are like down deeper maybe right now. I don't know. Yeah, this is a deep hole. It is a pretty deep hole right up there at the front. Yep. All right, guys, we're gonna head to a, another spot. Caught one or two fish from this hole. Colin caught a really nice rainbow and then I caught that short stubby rainbow. Yeah, it's a big one. No, he's not too, too big. He looks like he's blue, don't he? Or is it just my sunglasses? Yeah, this is better. Thank you. 
Oh, got him. Fish on. Oh, nope. Not a big one, but a pretty nice one. The brown bug. Nice. <laughs> Second trout of the day for me. Beautiful rainbow. Got him. Fish on. On the spinner. Nice. Look at that. That's right a pretty in the fish. Of the lip. Yep, right in the corner <laughs> of the mouth. Nice. Third yeah. rainbow of the day for me. On the spinner. All right, guys, I didn't tell you, but before I caught that fish, I switched to this little Joe's Fly spinner, and I have two tiny split shot on my line. This spinner is basically weightless, so I added the split shot so I could cast it farther and get it to sink deeper in the water column. This is a good little finesse spinner when the bite's tough. Let's see if we can pick up another one. I only got one out of that hole. I'm gonna move downstream and see if we can find another. Yeah. There he is. <laughs> Finally. Nice. <laughs> In the net. Fold it twice. Oh, he gone. Fish flop Friday, baby. There he is. Nice one. Oh, let's go. Woohoo! Beautiful rainbow, probably third cast with the Dynamic Lures HD trout in a rainbow pattern. He was hanging out right below that current, came up and smacked it. Thanks, bro. Appreciate all always, the help with the camera always, and net. Always. Here's a look at that lure I caught that trout on. Just working it deep, giving it some paws, paws, jerk, jerk. And they are definitely on a reaction strike today. I tried floating a bunch of stuff, gulp minnows, little soft plastics, all kinds of stuff. And I think I caught like one or two fish uh, with floating floating stuff and drifting stuff and as soon as I put on the spinner and uh, this jerk bait I started catching seems to be like I caught a few more fish this way and fishing this way is a lot of fun more active 
Collins hooked up with a giant. All right, I'm gonna try to get downstream of you. We are hooked up to a giant. Big bow. It's the JR Special J Special. Yes. Oh my God. Dude, that's a nice one. Awesome rainbow. Indiana, Pennsylvania. Welcome to the Yellow Creek Trout Club. This big female bit on the JR Special J Spec by Dynamic Lures. <laughs> Strong kick. Let's go. A big lure like that. I've been throwing little lures all day and then I upsize. Yeah, let's look Usually at it. You want to downsize, but upsizing worked today. It's stuck in the net, but that pretty orange, good size. That orange belly has a nice flash in that silver metallic design. Looks like a shad or any bait fish. So sweet. That's what I was mimicking and it worked. Nice. Probably biggest one of the day. That was at least a 24 inch rainbow trout. Yeah. Good job, man. We're going to head back upstream. We started out fishing downstream, just hole to hole. Now we're going to work away back upstream to where we started. And hopefully get on some more fish. I'm gonna keep throwing this little guy here for a little bit and see what happens. Fish. Oh. oh, holy moly. This is an absolute giant. Dude, this is a big one. I only got six pound test line, so definitely gotta take it easy. He's trying to get right back in that current. There, I got his head turned. Oh! Dang, he went all the way across, bro. <laughs> you got it. Keep that touching. We needed one for the road. Yeah. Hopefully he'll run out of gas soon. Dude, look at my rod. <laughs> look at that rod, Ben. Jump twice. Yeah. Should be tired he's coming, out. he's coming, he's coming, he's coming. To your right a little bit. Oh. He almost came in. This is crazy. This fish is so powerful. Holy moly. Come on, come on. This is a trophy fish. We just gotta stay calm. There he is, there he is. Yeah, yeah. Oh let's go. I don't think I've ever caught a tiger trout. Fish hawk. Tyler, <laughs> let's go. Give me do <laughs> the mission done, dude. Let's go. On a dynamic lure. Got him. <laughs> Might as well fight him for a while. The old bridge fish. Hard to beat a bridge fish. Another slow, steady retrieval on that one. Just cast upstream and brought it back down. Let's 
see what it is. Looks like a rainbow. Nice size rainbow. Hope oh, it doesn't go down there. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go down there and have a Yep. Nice. <laughs> Definitely a two-man job. Bridge fish. Oh, let's see if we can do that again. That was cool. I was just doing a slow, steady retrieve. Everywhere we've gone, no one's catching That is weird. Lately, that's how it's been. No one's catching on anything. It's like the dynamic. Got him. Oh, ho, ho, ho. it's huge. <laughs> it's big. Oh my gosh, guys. This is nuts. A big rainbow. This is going to be tough. This is going to be tough. Heck, I might try to get down. I might be able to get down. This is gonna be tough. Here you go. Don't let him cross it. Get him, get him, get him. I think he's right there. Oh no, he's a little too far. Oh, nice. Look at, that. Look at that. Popped right out. Oh, he gone. Deuces. <laughs> Quick release. All right, guys, that's two from the bridge. Now that I'm down here, I'm going to see if I can hook another. There he is. Looks like a rainbow. Pretty nice one. Not near as big as the last one, but it's still a good fish. Now I'm just going to stick down where I can net him. Oh, quick release. It's so crazy to me that earlier this morning I was using a drift uh, method and wasn't catching near as many fish and I put this jerk bait on and they just go absolutely bonkers for it like they didn't want anything finesse they were on an aggressive reaction strike and after I put this thing on it was lights out all right I think that's going to do it for this spot it's just been slow lately like the bite has been slow here yeah but it doesn't seem like it now huh? no and of course we we start here and then this guy moves with the fish. <laughs> uh, I tried not to push people off, but it happened. There he is. Ooh, that's a tank. Let me reel in, I'll net him. That's a nice bow, brother. Smoked it. He's trying to go upstream. Oh. Looks like another blue one. They do have, kind of have that color to them. It's deep here too. I'm tiring them out. It's crazy how strong these fish are. Yeah. Bring them on in. Oh, that's a 20 inch rainbow. That's a hook jaw rainbow. Awesome fish, brother. There he is. 
All right, guys, that is going to do it for today. Had a great day of trout fishing with Colin. We caught some really nice fish at Yellow Creek Trout Club. And um, I started out throwing the drift rig with a gulp minnow. Caught a few, didn't do too well though. So I decided to switch it up to the little jerk bait. Colin was absolutely killing it with the jerk bait. So of course I had to switch up and uh, just started slaying the trout. And I believe I caught my first ever tiger trout. So that was really cool. Just a beautiful day, 65 degrees, sunny, hardly any breeze. Just a great day. And now we're actually going to a Pittsburgh Steelers game uh, that Colin invited me to. So definitely pumped for that, even though I'm a diehard Cowboys fan. I love football in general, so it's gonna be a lot of fun. All the information for the gear I used will be down in the description if you guys wanna check it out. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button and also give me a thumbs up, it'll really help me out. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, thank you so much for watching. Fish Hulk out.